AITA for refusing to get rid of some of my clothes even though my partner thinks I have too many? My partner, 41M, and I, I, 34F, recently moved into a new home. He's covering the cost of the home and most of our expenses, he's well off, and for context, my net worth is about 3% of his. In our home, we have a walk-in closet. I currently use 60% of the closet, he uses 20%, and the remaining 20% is still available for him. We also have two guest bedrooms with large closets. Before we moved in together, we lived separately. When moving here, I was very intentional about which clothes I brought and used it as an opportunity to declutter and get rid of a lot of things I no longer wanted. My partner recently said to me, hey, I think we should go through your clothes and decide what to keep and what you don't wear or use, and we should get rid of those. I told him, sure, we can, but I've already done that before moving, and I'm only keeping clothes I want, so I don't think it's necessary. He insisted that we still go through them and said it's fine if we don't end up getting rid of anything, but he also added that he doesn't want to bring unnecessary stuff into our new home and thinks I have too many clothes. He even suggested we go through his things too, but I said I have no issue with how much he keeps or doesn't keep. To me, this feels unnecessary. We have plenty of space, and I already decluttered. I'm struggling to understand why this is even an issue. This isn't the first time it's come up either, he's mentioned it before, and the conversations usually end the same way. But last night, things escalated. I got upset and said, why can't I bring what I want into our home? He replied, fine, bring whatever you want, and why don't you pay for everything too? Then he left because he needed a break. Reddit, am I being unreasonable for not wanting to go through my clothes again? Edit, I made a clarification that he suggested we go through my clothes together, not that he wanted to do it himself to avoid confusion.